was so exciting because for 45 minutes, you were really just looking around, wondering where they were going to be next, what they were going to do next. It was just really awesome. This is where the Blue Angels were founded in 1946. So people who came out to the show today said they were so glad to have them back home. Watching the Blue Angels shoot across the sky with power and precision, it's easy to understand why so many people came out to see them at Naval Air Station Jacksonville. Air shows like this are the reason that I wanted to uh, you know, be a pilot when I was young. Daniel Russell became a Navy pilot, and now he's at the air show sharing his love of planes and the Blue Angels with his wife Courtney and two young sons. He loves airplanes, so he, uh, he watches uh, shows about them, reads books about them, so he, it was good to get him out here to see them. 45 minutes of breathtaking formations and maneuvers, all a sneak peek of what's to come at this weekend's air show at NAS Jacks. The show has a host of talented performers, some of whom showed off their daring moves for the crowd. I mean, it's really cool. I really like seeing all the planes, and I just like seeing them fly. Cameron King came with his family. They're from Pittsburgh and have seen the Blue Angels before, but wanted to see them again here in Jacksonville. I like seeing the Blue Angels, the precision. I've seen them all together. It's a camaraderie. It's really neat. Blue Angels have flown for more than 260 million spectators since 1946. A legacy many here say is earned and well-deserved. They're fast. They're loud. They're unique. You know, it's a very small group of people that get to be Blue Angel pilots. And that, as him being a pilot, that's just kind of a neat thing. Now, here's what you need to know if you're planning to come out this weekend. The gates here at NAS Jacks, they open at 9. The show starts at 10. The Blue Angels don't perform until around 3 o'clock in the afternoon, but organizers say you probably need to get here around 12.30 in the afternoon because they really expect a lot of people to be here and traffic to be backed up. Reporting live at NAS Jacks, Kamasi Aaron, Channel 4, the local station.